This is a demonstration on how to completely bypass the lock screen on Samsung's implementation of Android 4.1.2. It's running on the Galaxy Note 2. So if I lock my screen, you will see that I have a pattern lock. So miscreants cannot break in. But if I press emergency call and then try and dial an emergency number which doesn't exist, in this case zero, I get an error message. Dismiss that, and when I press the back button, you'll see the screen that I was previously on is displayed. So if I press emergency call, in case of emergency, and then hold down home, I go back to the home screen. And that's just about long enough to launch an app. So I'm going to try and launch Google Play. You might have seen Play just flip up there briefly. So if we go back to Play, let's just check. Yep, it's there. Now, what I have to do is try and search for something through Google Play. Not sure if that worked. What we're hoping to do is get voice search activated. No lock. Well, it seemed to find that, so let's go back into Google Play. So there's a variety of no lock apps there, so what they will do is disable the lock screen for me. And these are all just available on the normal uh, Google Play. So let me just try and... So that should be installing... Oh no, I need to say, yes, I do want to install it. No, nope, not yet. This is a uh, very tricky procedure. Lots of... Uh... Yep, so you can see there that is installing. Okay, so now we need to look at it. You can see there the shortcut has been created. So if we go to the home screen, let's just take a look at where it is. Right there. Okay, so with a bit of luck, I should be able to... Mm, not quite. Let's try that again. This takes a, a lot of precise clicking and timing in it. Oh, there we go, locking disabled. So I'm now able to go and into the settings and I can play about with uh, all of that, maybe format some stuff. And I can go back to the home screen and I can play with the apps. And there we go, the lock screen has been completely and utterly bypassed.